Hey, I'm Ryan Doggart and I'm from Belfast in Northern Ireland and I studied undergraduate Masters of Environmental Science. I'm Peter, I'm Ryan's twin. Um, I studied a um, Masters in uh, Computer Systems Engineering here in Bangor. The mountains, pretty much. I'm a mountain biker um, through and through and I do a bit of climbing so this was the, the, perfect, the perfect place. Yeah, me and, me and Ryan and the whole family, we used to holiday quite often in North Wales so Whenever we were looking for unis and like where to go, Bangor sort of felt like home away from home, so it was a good choice, really. My course is quite quite a split. Um, like my A levels were quite science based, so I did computer computing, um, and then I was leaning more to doing computer science, and then I came to Bangor and decided that I wanted to do engineering, and then computer systems engineering was the perfect split between computer science and engineering. So I really enjoyed both, like the practical stuff and the theoretical stuff. I just enjoyed being outside a lot of the time. Um, went to Tenerife for a week, which was unbelievable, free bar. Um, and yeah, just getting to learn more about the environment and plants, and that's, that's really what I want to do now, so it's really good. Weird. Um, can't believe it's actually happening. Um, it's cool that I'm graduating at the same time as my brother, which I didn't think was ever going to happen. Um, but yeah, really looking forward to seeing what's, what's happening after. It, it sort of feels like an end of an era, doesn't it? Like we've, we've, yeah, we've, we've spent a lot of time here. Um, so it's happy and sad because I'm going to miss the people a lot. So yeah, we'll see what the next chapter has in store. Yeah, I'm sure it'll be good. I think it's safe to say we've always been pretty competitive. Um, I never ever thought that I would get a first. It was, it was pretty much a cert for him. Um, but I was like, I'm going to try and, try and push through and get it done. But he still managed, even though I got a first, he still got this award. And so I've still lost, so it doesn't really matter. And so I've won the John Roberts Jones Prize um, for outstanding uh, academic achievement for the university, which is, which is really good. It, it's been a lot of hard work. Like, I've worked hard whilst I was here. It's nice to know that I motivated Ryan whilst not trying hard as well. But you know, yeah, it's, re it's a really special award and I'm looking forward to getting my hands on the piece of paper. And the money. And the money, yeah. <laughs> I would say the bike club um, that I spent all my four years with, they are so good um, yeah, and I'll be back to visit them. Um, I, I would say like the friends that I've made here are really like special people and, and like they're friends for life, like I'm going to keep in touch with them after uni which can, isn't the same with the school friends really. Um, but yeah, no, it's been good. A lot of what the best memories of Bangor can't go on film, so. Yeah. <laughs> I'm volunteering with the National Trust down in Cornwall at the minute um, and I'm trying to find a job in something like outdoorsy, sort of consultancy type stuff. Um, I start in uh, Jaguar Land Rover as a graduate research engineer on the 7th of September, so that, that's my graduate job lined up. Um, I've spent my last two summers there on placement, so they offered me a graduate job to stay on, so um, yeah, that, that was me sorted pretty early. Um, so that, yeah, it's really good. I've got two weeks of inductions and driving cars and things, so I'm really looking forward to it.